Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Night Dance for the round one of the 23-24 and the GIIR Division 1 season. I'm delighted to welcome my co-commentator uh, today, Campbell Classen, who uh, defied medical science by bursting his appendix by eating too much mayonnaise <laughs> in Argentina. So welcome along on board Cheers, Campbell. Logs, thank you very much. I'd just like to run through the turn your team. Uh, the 15 of Aaron Egan in his first AIL game for Connor Phillips also making his debut in the AIL at 14. Colin de Butler 13. Peter Sylvester 12. Craig Adams 11. Colin Smith 10. Finton Gunn making his home debut in the AIL for us. Conan O'Donnell making his debut in the AIL for us today. Sean McNulty. Adam Chute. Captain Harrison Brewer. Matt Caffrey. Conal Boomer. Luke Clausey and Jordan Cockton with the replacements bench of Tom Stewart, Conor McCormick, Mike Murphy. Keen Hooks with Alan Benny and Sam Berman. We're going to start with a minute silence for the great uh, Anto Anthony Flannery, who sadly passed away during the week. John Dixon, two Kyle McCall, three Harry McCormick, four jo Thomas Donnan, five Declan Horrocks, six Callum Irvine, seven Zach McCall, eight Bradley Looney, nine Chris Gibson, ten yeah. Jack Milligan, yeah. eleven Ethan Graham, twelve Mark Best, thirteen Paul Kerr, fourteen Aaron Cairns, fifteen Connor Rankin. And it's great to see that there's a, a boomer on both sides of the pitch today. One representing Terran Yer and his brother Patrick was on the bench for M. Um, Ballon Hinch. It's a great day for the family from the Boomerangs. Yeah, to family on both sides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Got me now, yeah. Patrick is on the pitch yeah. with uh, Colin is still there. So we will really get the class. Hey, like, like, so we used to come out on top. Ah, it's a tough one. Boomerangs actually. Yeah, I'm not good. So Patrick's just a crazy guy. So Kieran. Yeah, tough call. Oh, Phillips, Captain Green. Yeah, uh, Colin Smith's going to kick off. Good to go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Division one for Terry. Black, make sure you're all behind. We Don't have Sam Bolt, okay. referee in his first yeah. Division one A game. So best of luck to Sam. Go ahead, go. One thing I'd just like to say about it, Anthony uh, Flannery, he was an incredible supporter of Terry. Yeah, I all remember all these years ago when I came back to Terry. Yeah. We weren't probably doing as well as we are now. And there was a group of guys that used to turn up to every ground in the country. Anthony, Nick, Drew, Pat, Rob, and Rossi. And I support Terrier for four reasons. We believe that those type of guys who were there when we were we struggling a little bit had a big part to play in our success last year. So we'd like to extend our, extend our condolences to Anthony Fanny. Let's go here now. Just to the left of the mark. It's always interesting the first swim of the game. Campbell, you've been in many. Many, many. It's head in there. You don't really know what's going on. Hoping for the best. Pushing all of your life. It could be, uh, could be challenging all night long. So. An interesting up on a hinge where I think they're the last team to defeat Terrier in the AIL. Uh, they were, yeah, we played them up there and I grew some off day. Uh, they're a strong side at home. Uh, played up there for two years, you never know what sort of day you're going to get. But like, it's no one or sun split their off. Very friendly club though, it's a great place to go. Yeah, great place, good to live. Good place to start out my uh, playing career, so it was a great place. 
Great crack, a lot of fond memories with a lot of the boys. And I believe there is a crowd in the clubhouse today watching this game, so welcome to you all. I can hear them cheering, actually. Can you come? Yeah, I think I can. Yeah. Overcoming talent like Fenton Gunn. It's not a very good uh, World Cup for the under 20s. Yeah, yeah, over the summer's very played. Oh. Oh. I think that could lead to a card. It's an excellent move there. There is good by Callum's left. Great lines ran. Hopefully, Turner go for four series. Uh, Let's end it. Get us in the game. Number 11. He counts himself. Lucky that he wasn't. Very lucky. Having a shot? Yeah, we're going to go for the points. Post calls. Settling nerves, get into the game. Good start in the scrum, Campbell. It was solid, very solid by both teams. Big, big sides, physical sides. Should be entertaining. And how is the... The, the appendix? Ah, we're on the men. <laughs> another two weeks hopefully another two weeks or a week we'll see what we'll see what magnificent Billy comes up with see oh, if I can Billy get will sort you out don't worry about that <laughs> <laughs> and have you, are you off the main ace? off the main ace for a week well, well we'll see what if we get a Chinese and I don't know I might have to go back on it would you have mayonnaise with your Chinese? of course you have mayonnaise with your Chinese okay that's an unusual one and Aaron Egan puts the first points on the board for Terrier College. 3 0 after four minutes of play. Going down towards the clubhouse there, so this looks pretty strong. Getting behind you and don't step behind half players. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the hinge came out of the wrong side of the Leighton Cup semi final against your monster last week in the title. And we managed to get over the line in Sligo. Play on! Good take by Matthew Caffrey, I think. Carry back on the side of 22. Good now. Very good kick by Callum. Inside, inside. Good ground made by Turner there. Good clearance then by Connor Rankin. Back. I think he was away last Just year playing overseas in England. Give me time to get them set up. So he was back this year. That's your man there. It's good to see, always good to see talents return home to play. Exactly. A line out straight in front here, Cam. We'll get another call here now. Probably not on that. You're not ball. really a good one for your team, <laughs> though, aren't you? That's I'm you. more of a truck and go guy. <laughs> the, the, <laughs> not the brains, the operation. Just the looks of the operation, isn't it? It's a hint of a good steal there. So it was Tommy Donnan got up. That's good play by Hinch. Number one, a good carry by John Dixon. So it was Chris Gibson playing at nine. Very grumpy, angry man. I used to work on site with him, so I did. He was never one for the early chats in the morning. So particularly on a Monday. Particularly on a Monday. Now, I might not be there on the Monday, but particularly on a Monday. <laughs> the, act, the others told you that he was grumpy on a Monday, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, that was it. Great turnover by Connell Boomer there. Brilliant. Excellent turnover. There's a good bit of phase play by John the Hinch there. Where the ball is there, yeah. Close again, I think, with that wind behind us. Yeah, I silly knock It's a great day for rugby here in Lakers. The sun always shines in Lakers. It's always sunny. It's the TV show, isn't it? Yeah, we should get another one for the Irish version. Yeah, I think so. Get a good cast, you Skeener, lad. Jude could be in. We get you to, yeah, we get you to run the bar. Yeah, for sure. We've got to be a little bit quiet. Now Sorry, I didn't understand the question. They actually can hear us out there. <laughs> I think it's the first time people have listened to us when we've been doing the streams, so and we better watch it. <laughs> Kicking, let's pull that a little. 
Let's go, let's go. 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 Let's go.
your favourite style of play, Mogs. Army, Army. Say. You love a bit of Army, you do, oh Mogs. No Army, no more. <laughs> No I think, army, uh, no party. I think Bob Marley had a song, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> he did. Great to see Harrison Burr out there wearing the four jersey again. He absolutely loves that jersey and wearing it. Very happy man to be in the role in the engine room. Harrison Burr is a bad He's actually pushed his very new college backwards from these phrases. Matthew Caffrey, hard man to stop when he's on the rumble. Good defence. of the ball, it's great defence. Great defence by Hench, we'll say. Don't have any snipes, having a look, seeing if they're still awake. Great carry by Mr. Zimmer. That's your man, that's your man blocking the ball. It's a superb bit of play by Barney Hinch. Brilliant bit of defence. Getting their double shots in, getting people in around them, and then getting a man, second man in over the ball. Brilliant and well done by Hinch. So it was. On the five. Thirteen minutes gone, turning it lead by three points to the Mark Best, kicking in the touch. Good thing about Best, he was also trying to go pro with the cricket this year, so he was. Oh, he was. Is he cricket or hard? Is he pro with it? Good there. That's the wrong man. I'll check him. Also, he will figure it out straight away. Is he playing good? Is he playing rap cricket? Amazing technology. Things you can find out. Good lineup by Hinge. Well controlled. Three out, out three, out, out. You're out, out two. Don't change the point. Do not change. That's one. Excellent play. You know, you're not a big cricket fan, Mom. Oh, I am. It's a bit, it's a bit a of a spoof of if you don't know who the who is there. It's high tackle there. Well, it's the colour clothing sort of good. I think that's the away strip. I've <laughs> <laughs> played a lot of cricket over the years, Camel. Yeah. Famous Ten, story. Just, just bend at the CYM was CYM. There, into the corner. That's a good play. After here, we can have so many 22 entries and now they're coming out with a score. We may look to sort of put a bit of width on the ball this time, Campbell. We have great pace on the edges. We saw you, Craig Adams and Paul Phillips and Aaron Egan there. We need to let them boys loose. Let them loose and let them get after. Credit to Bonner Hinch, they defended incredibly well. Advantage. Well, advantage well well by Fenton Oh, brilliant snipe by the young fella. He's a serious talent to behold at the minute. I know, but I just kicking away a penalty, kicking away the ball because you have a penalty. Oh, it's just sort of something that grates a little bit with me. Out the side, don't always the tap and go Roll against Belvo on Monday. There was a, there was a couple of people unhappy with the entire round well. 22. What, uh, what was the end result? Well, I mean, you can't take you can't take credit for that. Well, what was the end result? We went up there was the other a score end about 10 it. minutes later. It was, and it was in the same passage of play as they'd say. The clock hadn't stopped. <laughs> <laughs> Famous yeah. last words, it's all cats and stuff. Yeah. Look, our coaches are a bit upset, I think, that evening. Thanks. Thanks. Much better break than next. Thanks very much. Apologies if there's some volume issues, but Campbell has actually solved them. <laughs> I'm a genius, I am. Oh, 
I can't handle it. I'll have to be quiet again, he might be able to hear us. After turning up the volume. Good strike down for our game turning over six points to nil lead after 17 minutes of the game. Kinda we need a we need a score with that breeze behind us. We're kinda leaving it a lot of work to do in the second half playing up into it, but in fairness to us we don't mind the hard work. Very competitive game for the first game of the season in the AIL. Try and be nice to spice things up with yeah. it, Boggs. No. Brilliant drop off. Brilliant drop off by Jack Milligan there. Well hung in the air, so it was tough to take. Knock on, scrum down, pinch ball. Such good uh, attacking platform for Ball in the Hinge now. It'll be very exciting back line on paper. Both teams, yeah. by all accounts. It's also number 14 for Hinch, Aaron Cairns. It's his birthday today. Age, you want to think about retiring very soon. He must be nearly 47 if mine stands correctly. I think it's 46 actually. Ah, that'd be right. No? I suppose he was a young man when I was up there, Moggs. He was a young man when I was up there. That's not what he said about you, though. <laughs> Leave that. I imprint a good memory of, uh, of myself on everyone I meet. Certainly a memory. Certainly a memory. Always a memory. Yeah. Good or bad, that's yeah. up to you to decide. Well, the worst thing about being talked about is not being talked about, Camel. <laughs> that's, that's it, Mark. That's it. Hopefully now we get after this scrum. Shot to Adam Chod in a great oh yeah Adam oh. Chod in a great great position there really doing well putting John Nixon under pressure uh, to see where Adam Chod started to see where he is now it's actually incredible he is the most improved player year on year puts in a great effort and uh, he just reaps the rewards so well done Adam excellent scrum probably should have took the ball out a little bit before the pressure came on there. Just like to say hello to Ruby, Adam Mila's girlfriend, who seems to come all the way from Toronto to listen to my live streams. She must like you, Mogs, well, or like the lucky, yeah, one or the other. Or the voice, I think she comes She from. likes the voice. Yeah. Like getting a bit of a following, I believe, in <laughs> Toronto. But great line out by Sean McNulty, great take. Great defence. Attack him that's fine, he's fine. Advantage. Turnover. Sean McNulty doing really well on the D to drift. Harrison on the ball. No Great tackle. On the ball. It's a good clear out by Balna Hinch. Balna Hinch playing good brand of rugby, this moving it tight to side. Leave it now. Great counter up by Peter Sylvester there. Slowed the ball down enough for the defence to be reorganised. Hint's playing a really good brand here, attacking, moving it side to side, having a lot of options. Great, great turnover. Left side on the side probably would have won the turnover every for men being on the ball. We've got Harrison Brewer doing really well to get over the ball. I just think teams should try to just stay on their feet more, maybe all found a little bit before the contact and keep the ball alive. Because once it's gone on the ground, the whole team have been very good. On the jackal, as they call it. Campbell. That's it. That's, That's it. the in word this season. The jackal. The jackal. Sorry. It's like this one back. loosened. I think it's with the defensive. That's a new one everybody's using, isn't it? What? What's your word? Loosen. Word of the day? Loosen, is it? Loosen. I thought it was loosen. Loosen. Translucent. Yeah. I can be translucent sometimes. <laughs> but you hear it from every team you see it at the same time. It's a one meter space only. The buzzwords. Yeah. The buzzwords. Well, people make a lot of money out of those words. Another great line out dart by Sean McNulty. Oh. Oh. Get the ball. Well done, Sean McNulty, to get the ball back. Great carry again by Peter Sylvester. We need play. Army again, Mogs, your favourite brand. 
We need quicker ball and we need to go out the back at some stage. This is a good change of the right now we're on. But, um, Silva loves being a pattern ram, so he does. Ready to be strong in contact, but it's a great. Oh, he's on that. Another, another jackal. That's three jackals in a row for Hench every time we've entered the 22. Is that Kyle? Look, that was number Kyle. Three. That was Kyle McCall, the tight head. He's down here. Is obviously that's not. Yeah, I don't know what happened. Harry McCormick's over on the bench there. I see he must have got in. Uh, I can see him sitting there in the Hench dugout. Don't know what happened to him. And I think we'll be very happy with the way this game has gone so very far. Very happy, especially with the wind in our favour and their control. They're kind of controlling the game, Moggs. They're dictating it to us, so we've got to step up our game. And start getting in the green zone. <laughs> Another buzzword. Another buzzword. How long do they have to hold? The mall was still moving, so there's no time at the mall moving forward. Thank you, sir. It's a very good play for a couple. Attention for a few guys. Thanks very much. So they're Latin. So I've been taking my shows at the World Cup. I've watched a couple of games. I was actually watching who was playing last night. France, Italy. France are a team of the old man. Inside, they were pretty good, so they were last night. Italy didn't put up much of a fight, but France are some good ball, though, don't they? The France are impressive. They like to play. They like to play. We'll be under a bit of pressure now this evening with Scotland. Ah no, I think that would be. We'll be okay tonight. We'll be okay, will we? I think so. Building up nicely, hopefully, for a couple of cracking quarter finals. Mm. So, if, you, if you're looking for someone to watch the game tonight, <laughs> Lakelands is open at five o'clock with her, with, and you can watch myself and Campbell on the big screen at <laughs> half five. Oh, brilliant, brilliant by it. That's two overthrows by it. Play, well, play the edge. Oh. I don't know. That's good points up for Craig. Oh, carried over the line. Scrum five. Scrum five, tearing your carried over the line by Ballin Hinch. He did the best he could. I think he was under a lot of pressure there. So nice yeah. kick through by it was, a, it was a nice kick through by Cullen the Butley. Yeah. I'll keep you right, bro. With a father. <laughs> With a father. That's right. The Butley. Father. <laughs> <laughs> you can't forget the father. You're, uh, we're, what about our competitors? They weren't happy when we heard about the commentating teams, Connor Pender and George Morgan. They weren't too best pleased, weren't they? Not well, look, 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 look. You have to pick the best team. Cream, the cream, the, the crop, the cream always rises to the top, exactly. isn't that yeah, it, Bob? They're, they're, like, they're young lads. They, you know, they're a bit of work to be done. Bit they? of work to be done. We'll get them there, though. Bit of coaching always. Exactly. <laughs> Very important scrum for Terry. Yeah, we need to get over here. We need to score. So I'll tell you, come second half, Hinch are just going to plant the ball down in our half the whole time. Okay, we are. Hold the space, we spoke about pre-game. Have you done it? Fifteen minutes left in this half. Ternier really need a score, so they do. To settle into it. And then it'll be a big D-set in the second half, you know, keep us in the game. And you're always a tough opponent. Get harder and harder as the years have gone on. Adam should again putting John Dixon under a lot of pressure. I just think both front rows went down there, I think. The ref is right to reset the scrum. He probably needs to chase his feet under him a wee bit, give himself a wee bit more support, paint a better picture to the ref. Feet underneath. Good body high piece. Form up. Shannon are 7 3 up against UCD and uh, Tarfer 14 5 up in College Park. 14 3 up, sir. I just got a video text there from uh, 
Oh, no. A high tackle. Just got a text there from James Thornton. He actually put us on mute box. So we did, which is kind of sad to see. A stalwart of the club letting us down, not showing us any support. How did we know? We're on if we're on. If he knows we're on. Oh, he actually listened to us. Yeah, and then he put was us listening on. to us and then put us off. It was a bit sad for him. It's a bit of a turkey anyway. <laughs> Sorry, four. So your tie head popped up, and then the back five started to set the scrum around as well. Yeah, just yeah. 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 that picture again will be good, please. Actually, did not see what happened there. So. Well, you're on the phone. Yeah. 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 That's it. No phones allowed, is it? Mogs, that's exactly. Hard to win with you today, Mogs. You know, did you have? Did you get a good night's sleep? Everything okay? Yeah, got up early. Referee the game of first years. How, who won? Who was the other one? Who we won against? Of course, they did. No doubts with you. <laughs> Big scrum here again. For Terry, we really need to get something out of this. Good reward. Looks like the turf's getting dug up a bit. So it is. Shutsy again in a really strong position. That's brilliant. Forcing the ball slipped out. Oh, great, great tackle. Great tackle. Oh, oh just okay. short. Just Very short well by played. Jordan Coughlin. Great. Did really well there. Not to reach out. Penalty five. Yeah. Probably has to be a card here. Holding the ball, stopping it from being quick ball and being played for Ternier. So it was clearly a tackle, there was no release. Hinch did really get in it I, uh, as well. good defence there. I think the card's a bit unlucky. Myself. I don't know, you can't really stop him from playing the ball though. I know you're trying to stop your own line, but you can't stop him from having a quick ruck ball. Well, Maybe what he was trying to do was roll him over the line and get him held up. Should so. have been very clever. Yes. I can see a scrum coming. Yeah, they should go for the scrum. With a man down. Again, big for Terran here. They've been very dominant in this area in the scrum all day. So they have. Spent a huge amount of time in the Van Lange 22. Very little reward though. The defence by Van Lange was excellent there. Some super tackles being put in. Great to see my fans showing me big support out there. My new gig, my new endeavour. You're getting a lot of praise online here, Campbell. That's it. It's the Donegal accent, it works wonders. Indian file. Oh! oh. Big slip up from Ternier. Big slip up from Ternier. It's an injury here to Ooh. one of the Ballon Hinch lads. I think we have a bang in the head here. Always hate to see that sort of stuff in a game. Fortunately, there's not a lot you can do to prevent it. Who is it? Is it Bestie? I think it could be Bestie. Key, very influential player for Hinch as well. Break and play here. Going into the last 10 minutes of the first half. Ballon has been very pleased with their performance so far. 100%. Managing to withstand everything we're throwing at them, sticking it up to us. In the second half, I think that win could dictate a lot. Hopefully, now we can stick in the fight. Looks like the Mark Best is okay, is he? He's a tough bugger, so he is. 
In fairness to Basti, he'll stick in the fight. Interesting now, Battle Hinge is put in on the scrum in their own 22. It's a big moment, this scrum. Easy let out for Battle Hinge there with the knock on from Harrison, unfortunately, but got to control it there when we have it. Colin Bimmer has been very quiet, so he has throughout the game. Not getting on the ball as much as he usually likes that. It's better scrum by Hinch. Great tackle by Luke Clossy getting off the scrum. This one will be kicked. Get them out of trouble. Grumpy himself, Chris Gibson. Oh, very close to blocking down that. I think it might have been touched. Not sure. What the on? I think the touchy is giving it to Terenier. Terenier ball. Still in a good position, Moggs. We should really come away with something here. What do you think? This is an important passage of play. It's seven minutes to go till half time. Bosco doing a great job on the scoreboard today. He got the clock a bit dodgy last week. Yeah, he was up against it. Time's against him, if anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, he actually had too much time on it last week. <laughs> oh, it's Can it. oh. oh, Callum Smith does really well to keep the ball alive, keep it in our hands. Superb. Offloads God. to Peter Sylvester. Oh. Fenton Gunn should look to go quick, maybe. It's an interesting decision we have, turn you have now. Corner. Corner, Corner. Oh, he's going to take for the his points. points. He's going to take his points. It's probably the right decision, actually, considering the amount of time he spent in the 22 without getting a score. So hopefully we'll dig in, grit it out. Hard dog for the old road. In the second half, Moggs. So we will. There's an eerie silence around Lakelands today. It's weird, yeah, no support, it's a tough one. Normally this place is hopping. It's like the limelight in Glenty's back in the day. <laughs> you can hear a pin drop. You could. Nice strike by Aaron. Turner Cos going to his nine point to nil lead with five minutes left to go in the half. Keeping the scoreboard taking over. Jack Milligan will be wanting to hit one of his trademark drop offs again. Hang it nice and high in the air. Make it contestable. Great drop off. The wind's obviously Great catching that, that nicely. Well taken Luke Colossi with a brilliant take. Superb catch. Great smack down. Down. Down the field by Callum Smith. Connor Rankin trying to take them out of trouble. Good kick. Aaron Egan trying to run it back. Great player. Nice pace. That's great pace. Craig Adams running after it. He's like a greyhound. He's that quick. Well played. Oh, brilliant by Ternier. Oh. It's well taken. We're back in the 22 again, Moggs. It's a good opportunity. I think Bala Hinch has secured the ball. Got themselves out of trouble, out of jail. So they did. 
Line out to Turner just outside the 22. Breeze looks like it's dying a wee bit. Hard to know we're in the shed and oh, shelter. This is probably worth a few bob. Where'd you get it? I uh, built it myself actually. You're in the carpentry. Are you looking for? Are you taking on man at the yeah, minute? Yeah, are yeah, you? I'll give you a gig. Looking for a gig. Trade up. Always looking to learn more mugs. I am. It's very comfortable in here, isn't it? It's not bad. Fits yeah. three. Yeah, comfortably. All we needs a couple of cans now. <laughs> Good all line out, well take by George up the middle. Oh, great tet on Jordan Coughlin there, not an easy man to stop on his tracks. That's good play out the back. Craig good Adams trying to get round Paul Kerr. Paul Kerr does really it? well to. Here's this. It's an opportunity now. Oh, yes, we're on. Glute Claw running a great line. Well done, Luke Craig Claw. Scott. Unbelievable play by Ternier. Shows you what we can do. Keep Excellent. the ball in hand, Moggs. You're right. Particularly inside the 22, put a bit of width in the ball, and that was an excellent score. Your IT, Moggs. Extremely well taken. It's great. Oh, the butter did excellent there on the wing to keep the ball in play and kick inside, and it was. Very good team try, Campbell. It was indeed. Great to see, keeping the ball alive. Great spin move by Colm the Butler. Great line off his shoulder then by Luke Claw. Luke Claw had a lot to do to finish it and he did unbelievably well. Great player, so he is. Does really well to... Here's this. an opportunity Aaron Egan lining up the conversion oh yes we're on Luke Claw running a great line well done Luke great Claw score. unbelievable play well done Aaron Egan well slotted kick hopefully we can put that Foot in the throat now and get back down there again. <clears throat> 16 points to nil as we go into the last minute of the first half. Hinch will be happy enough going in at half time, I think So, yeah. And their three starts have been very impressive. They have. Gone a wee bit longer. Take away Finally get Boomer. to see Colin Boomer on the ball. Oh, great t tackle on him by Tommy Donnan. Oh, straight down the pitch. Not as clean a strike as always from Cam Smith. Could have done better with that one. Oh, great. Well done by Harrison Brewer to get a last ditch attempt on him. John Aranka made a good Oh, great there. read by but Colin de Butler to get in his face and on the ball. Let's go! We have time for the scrum. We do indeed. What would you be telling them, Oggs? Go for a penalty and put it over the bar. What would be your verdict on this one? I think we should try and create the space on the outside, would be my opinion, Campbell. Running rugby like the barbarians. That's it. It's always a good platform around the, this position in the pitch to attack Tis. you've got the 8 donkeys or the 16 donkeys within it <laughs> they are radius of each other so they can't get in the way that's it so the donkey could still be at home in the turf and the bog huh Another big, big scrum. Two big packs going at it all day. Terry and you seem to be edging it at the minute. It's been a fair few scrums in the half so far. There Canada. has. You wouldn't think it for a dry day too, but no. there has. Who's doing commentary today? <laughs> what? Oh, you're, you're. 
We have a guest into our guest uh, speaker from Val the Hench, so we do. There's the pen. Oh, I'm what? looking at. Do we have a card? Do we have a card coming up here, Moggs? A little bit of a chat. And he's having a word with ex pro Kyle McCall. You think he'd know better at this stage? He's doing it long enough. Chutzy's doing well, so the boys are doing well in there. It's a great kick by Callum Smith. Turn your willing to play as well. This is a good sign. Time's gone. We're kind of into extra time in the half here, so. Turn your willing to keep it in play, so we are, and keep the game going. We want another score, which is good to see. But Balnehen's doing really well so far to keep us out, Moggs, huh? Yeah, the defence has been very impressive. Good take by Luca Claw. Is he at all? Good old trustworthy Luke Claw. We have advantage too. Brilliant. I think that was a wee bit unlucky, that penalty. But obviously taken out in the air. Back for the penalty. I could see a card coming. Interesting. We're still going to keep going for it, Moggs. Great well, like to see. In fairness to the, the referee, he's he's chatted to the captain. He's having to work to have a word with the player. So I think next penalty might be a card, a second card actually. Into the four or five scrum penalties now. You think there would have been a card already? You know. Definitely the last play of the half. Hinch have their famous Scotty Too Hotty on the bench. He used to, when I was up there, Scotty was my weakness. He used to bend me up like a pretzel, so he didn't. Oh even... my. That's... Oh, a bit of a let off there, but half time here at Lakelands Turnier College 16, Ballon a Hinch 0. have their famous Scotty too hotty on the bench he used to when I was up there Scotty was my weakness he used to bend me up like a pretzel so he did oh even... my That's...
Welcome back to Lakelands for the second half. Just an update from scores around the country. Uh, UCD 3, Shannon 7, Lansdowne 17, Young Munster 7, Trinity 10, Clontarf 19, and UCC, yeah, Corcon and Armar is a, a late stream game. Good deep kick from Ban Lynch to start the game off. Good take by, by Jordan Coughlin. April Cohen with Doherty through the middle of the rook. It's a very good start by Turnier at the second half. Looking to put the ball wide. Good defence again by Ballina Hinch. They've been very impressive in their defensive line. Of, of close in at the rooks and out wide. So this is going to be a very competitive second half. It's important. The third quarter is the big one in most games. So it'll be interesting to see who will get on top for the start of this half. Ballina Hinch have done very well to keep tearing your base he's back at the 22 back to Colin Smith for a kick good take by Connor Rankin it's a very good start to the half by both teams looking to move the ball a little bit wider from the, from the rock Jordan Coughlin doing well to get back up in the line there again. Oh. That looked like, oh, knock on there, turn your scrum down. Very good contest there by Harrison at the breakdown, which certainly made a difference. Aaron Cairns in front of me, still a specimen of a man, 14 for his age, he's in great shape. He actually got married there recently over the summer, so he did cry congrats to Cairnsy. Well done. Looks like a man who hits the gym. He does, he's a crossfit enthusiast, he's also good at timber, good with making stuff with timber, so he is. Head him up if you're looking for any special designs and tables, Moss. Oh, and chairs. Yeah, exactly. We were thinking of putting an extension onto the commentary box. So <laughs> would he be able to do that? <laughs> he probably would. Oh, well, we're going to put it up on Airbnb. One night only in Lakelands. Yeah. Dre where dreams happen. <laughs> Memories are made. First scrum of the second half of Funting Gun to put in the ball. Oh, oh, great no, scrum by Terenier. Again, this is great scrum by Terenier. I do. This will probably lead to a card, which is slightly unfortunate. It's a tough pill to swallow for Kyle McCall. I just, to be honest, I think that was a tough one because I thought our loose head went down off his feet, but we were going forward, so momentum was with us. I think it's the made. succession of penalties that First scrum of the second the half, Funton Gun to put in the You ball. know, you don't um, yellow card a, a winger for missing four tackles. Oh, oh great a scrum by Terenier. I think it's a little hard. Great scrum by Terenier. I do. There, you wouldn't think it's that harsh. I'll tell I know, you that but much. I just feel that you're not doing anything illegal. You're just losing the battle. But what do I know about the front row, Campbell? That's it, Muggs. You I have a lot. <laughs> <laughs> you get to stand out there yeah. and look pretty. But you've got a, a, a admirer behind you there, Campbell. See, my jacket's gone yeah. missing. Uh, someone's a uh, kind hench fan is taking it on a walkabout. Well, he must can't be blame one of the Terranier supporters, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> They're normally up for a lot of blame. Good old trustworthy claw at the front again, get things. It's worked very well at the rumbling. number two. Oh, nice break. This is a bit of go forward ball. Oh, yes, well done by Callum Smith. Great carry. Excellent. Sets down break. Jack Milligan. Oh, oh, I think we have another serious injury. Hopefully he's okay. This isn't good. We've got a flag in here from the touch judge. Well, at the that 
probably a tough one to call, Jack Milligan's very upright in the tackle there. As long as he's okay. Hopefully he's okay. Hopefully he's okay. Callum okay. was probably. Chest, probably on the chest and rises up. So there's, a, there's a devil of danger there. So I'm talking about yellow card if it's indirect contact. Okay. And okay. what number is it? The player at the scrum cap is it? Uh, no, the scrum cap is near 10 ball carriers. I think it was 12. Okay. Can I have your caps on the ball carrier, please? It's this player here. Yeah. Okay, so what we have is a picture where you're leading into contact with clear separation. With clear separation, you're leading with your elbow. The direct contact is there and slides up onto the head, so it's going to be a yellow card. Oh, no. I think it's very difficult when that defender is upright like that. You're always going to have a collision. It's tough. It's tough. It certainly wasn't an intentional one. Just the main one is, he's please okay. God, he's all right. Yeah. Yeah. Fairness to the referee, he was helped there by his assistant, so good refereeing all round, Campbell. Always good to see, always good to see. <laughs> Line out to Balna Hinch just inside their own half. It'll be an interesting 10 minutes now. Alain Hinch will certainly look to turn the screw now with uh, Turner down to 14. Both teams on 14. Hinch are down a pro. Yeah. As long as there's no scrum. That's it. Great contest by Luke Claw. Playing an advantage. Playing in the, playing in the air. I Silly penalty to give away. He's been, yeah, he's just got his arm. He's enthusiastic to say the least. And this, this believe me, God, it, yeah, there's, a, it, there's only one. <laughs> one of the four, lad. <laughs> he's making up for the numbers with his enthusiasm and his voice, so fair play to him. That's it. Very good attacking position here for Ball on the Hinge. It's always a decision that the defensive team have to make whether to contest or just to stay down. What's your opinion on these things, Campbell? Six, six plus one going for a mall here. So they are. Zach McCall in there on the ball. Ternier looking to blitz it. chutzy has got a headed earlier, in my opinion. They have a good drive on. I would be of the opinion to contest the ball in the air in these situations myself. You're under a bit of pressure, you see. If you jump in the wrong spot and they get the back the back slot, you're under a big bit of pressure. Yeah, but I'd be... Oh. Great defence by Peter Sylvester, I think it was. Great defence, targeted the ball. Excellent like, play by Peter there. By, it's a bit like GAA, he targeted the ball, slapped it out of his hand, it was brilliant play. How's your GAA season gone? Well, the seniors actually lost to Gidor. It was a difficult yep. match. It was good, good day for the parish, but hopefully we'll do better next year. Two cousins playing on the team. One of them actually is the second leading scorer in the championship, and he's oh. put out. So he was. And did you tug out yourself this summer? I was playing reserve. I don't be playing senior. I did talk out though a couple of times coming onto the pitch we've got Scotty too hotty my arch nemesis great player again another fellow who's just progressed and progressed well, we've got a ch for Hinch a change of 10 there we have number 20 Dominic Clapcott Clapcott yeah Clapcott to get my glasses another score coming from other games happening Shannon 14, UCD 3. Must be another humdinger of a game. Uh, 
That's your your friend came on in the front row there, I presume, Campbell. It was. Quiet, eerie place, Lakelands with no support. Normally it's quite loud. The fans make a world of difference. Hinch down one in the back line, so there's a bit of space somewhere with Kernsey in it. Six there. Brilliant! Another Certainly on top in the scrum turn here. John Dixon under a bit of pressure again. Next score is very important in this game. UCD just go over against Shannon. UCD 10, Shannon 14. Exciting. Start for Emmett McMahon in his role as director of rugby in UCD. Emmett spent a number of seasons this with, with ourselves in Terranier and he did a fantastic job. Sad time, to so. see him go, Mark. Sad to see him go. It'll be great for him to get a good start in their first game, though. Ah, we'd be happy for Emmett. Just about. Just about. Another Again, Truck Claw just coming up clutch. Big moments call for play. big players. It's been excellent in the line out. Ernest to Ballon and Hinch, they're not giving a yard. And when we Great take kick that ball, by Aaron Egan. Opportunity now to move the ball. Oh, great vision there by Connor Rankin. I think it's going to go just dead. On Execution, not just Good there. Good take by Paul Barr there at the back. I just thought he was going to counter it back there when he got the ball in his hands. <laughs> He'd be a much man of the same idea of yourself, Moggs. Running rugby, running rugby, keep it alive. Bit unlucky there. He's got the first bounce, just went forward. It's turning here a good attacking opportunity just from the halfway line here. With yet another scrum, Campbell. Another scrum. Good vision though by Connor Rankin. He's seen the space, just his execution was off, but idea's right. Can't fault a man with a good idea. Certainly is a game of scrums. That's it. Alan Benny is on for Vinton Gunn. Another old man that needs a run around. Needs a bit of oil on the knees to get them going, I think, these That's days. It. WD 40, Moggs, WD 40. Maybe someday I'll need it. At the moment, it's ah, okay. You're still motoring well, Moggs. You're yeah. still motoring well. Oh. Oh, God. Benny with a crazy pass. Turn your reacting well. Good depressure. I think we'll be going back for the knock on. I think I'd always let the hand have it again. Bit space. of space out wide here if they move it. Claw doing really well to get across. This is very good play by Ball the Hinge. Keeping the ball alive. Good tackle by Peter. Has to be Turn, you're doing really well to get off the line here. It's a bit of space out wide if Hinch can use it early. Lovely pass over the back. Oh, superb feet. Great finish by Ternier, or by Balnahinch. Ethan Grain, that was a class bit of footwork. A try they probably deserve, so this is this game is getting exciting now. The wind will have a big impact. As he sauntered back, sauntering back up, he's delighted with himself. The old man's 45, well, he's still got it, he's roaring in at me. Twinkle Toes, I think, was there. Twinkle Toes is right, Twinkle Toes is right. Was he a dance floor or was he a... He's a good operator on a dance floor, he could shuffle all right. So he was. Probably in the break dancing days, <laughs> That's right, Ballymun had their own 
yeah. break dancing club. Exactly. Hero. Although you're from what you, what you you're we Daniel country, oh, so Daniel Daniel's a great singer. We'll have to be quiet for Connor Rankin too now, Mox. Respect the kickers. Yeah. Nice strike by Connor. Just pulled it across. Good strike, across though, good connection. It's, it's good D pressure. 16-5 to turn here, 25 minutes on, left. I know he's left behind Shabbat again. Bit space. of space out wide here if they move it. Claw doing really well to get across. This is a very good play by Ball the Hinge. Keeping the ball. Your jacket's alive. back, Campbell. Jacket's back. The enthusiasm's still there though from him. Well, obviously that try will give more energy to the support. Discipline! Discipline! They're playing some good ball now, Ball the Hinge. Well done by Peter Sylvester, a good physical challenge. It's a very strong game in the middle today, Peter. With again, the take by Connor. Oh, bit High unlucky. tackle. High tackle penalties. A wee bit unlucky. Yeah. Hinch, the Hinch Yellow has returned as well. Kyle McCall back in from his sin bidding. So then hopefully he'll have a bit more manners on the field now. <laughs> I think I see Sam Berman running onto the field as well for Ternier. Young centre from St. Michael's. Brilliant, brilliant prospect for the future. I'm wondering to see who we replaced. It's, it's Callum Smith he's come on for. Yeah, Aaron Egan in a 10. Are you, so that's our yellow card gone that's as well. That's our yellow card gone as well. Great take in the line out there. Again, back into scrums. This is where we're dominant. You know, we hope to keep it here. We enjoy a scrummage, scrummage. We do, yeah, but it's, you know, it's... It's boring. It, well, it's six. But people who know the dark arts, there's probably something in it for them, but it's... And I'll tell you, I ain't one of them, Mouse. Aaron Egan's first real tester, a 10 for us. Let's see what he can do now. Big, big challenge ahead for him. He's had a fantastic couple of years in Trinity. Great player, so he was. Try UCD and it's converted, so that's UCD the lead against Shannon, 17-14. Great to see M McMahon doing well in his first year. Good tackle. Great take by Jordan. Great carry by Jordan Coughlin. Call Boomer. Great pass by Arn Egan, the no luck, well always done, catches man. boys out. Oh, well done well by done Craig, Craig Adams. Yeah. Great timing onto that run there. Bit of a confuffle going on in front of us. We'll have to see if anything comes from it. Luke Claw off the ball stuff, handbags. I will, that ball is out. Well done, to Adam Chute. Notice that. This is good play by Terrenier. Keeping the ball alive. Oh. Penalty. Another great turnover. Great turnover. Great turnover. Superb turnover there. By the hooker. Clayton, Clayton Mulligan. Great turnover by Clayton. Good play by Terrenier there. Momentum unfortunate. We need to get up on the line out if we go for if they're gonna go for a touch, we need to get up on the line out defence, get a few balls. You could say at this stage that the defences are winning out in this game today, Campbell. That's the big one, your defence. If you can stick with it. Lansdowne beating Young Munster 22 to 7. Yeah. 
in that game is happening in Lansdowne. So Lansdowne making a return this year, Mogs. Yeah, they were very impressive in the Leinster Senior Cup final. Another one of our coaches last year, Simon Malone, is now in the coaching staff of Young Munster. Another sad man to see leave. Brian just informed me that it's also being streamed, so it is. So we'll always help a man out when he's trying to do well. It's great Good line out take by Ballon Hinch. Good take. This is good play by Hinch. Oh. Great to get the line out. Just the far side of the 10. Turn your ball. And Benny looking to go quick. I have a question here for you, Campbell. Who wrote the day of the jackal? Who wrote the day of the jackal? Whoever sent you that, Moggs, they should probably wonder if they should go back and repeat the leaving for English. Okay, right, so I'll leave it at that. So it wasn't me. Great line out by Ternier. Well done, good. Oh, great play by Anne Benny, kicking behind. Ball sits up nicely. Sean McNulty threw on it. Probably would have kept that in the hand, Campbell. Just giving the ball Great back. Great defence by Ternier again, putting them back, Fairness not letting them get the gate the line. Top. This could be a good opportunity for Craig to have a go. Great feet, Craig. Well played. And Excellent. strong, big strong lad. Had three defenders there. Conan and all. He had a little bit of a shimmy earlier on. Clayton, Clayton Milligan doing really well to get over the ball again for Val Hinch. Great turnover. So it is Clayton starting at hooker. That was a superb turnover. It's a decision to be made here. We're going to have a shot at a goal. Keep the scoreboard ticking over, as they say, Moggs. Mark O'Neill has now moved upstairs, as they say, at the end of his illustrious playing career. Technical advisor <laughs> is the title. <laughs> Great servant to turn your... And we're very an invaluable member of the backroom invaluable, staff. Invaluable, Moggs, invaluable. There's a nice hand on the camera. 24-19 to Trinity. Trinity v Contar, Trinity leading. It's a great comeback by Trinity. It's a lovely strike. That's over all the way. Mogs out. Mogs, your etiquette kind of went out the window there for Conor Rankin kicking, you know. I know, it's just. He can hear you. <laughs> well, I didn't actually put him off, though, did I? No, he still got it. Maybe you should have yeah. talked on the last one and he I might know. have got it over. Yeah. This is going into a very important phase in the game. Next score is huge. Paul Kerr receiving. Cal Seth was telling an old RBAI student. Left foot. It's a superb kick. Great kick, great exit. That's a 50-22. Well, it's from 22 to 22. 22. Great exit on his left left foot. Great kick by Dominic. His brother, Pat Laddick, has uh, entered the pitch. Pat Laddick, he has many nicknames. So he does, let's see now the boomer rivalry, the family, the household, it's everything's on the line here. They're both on the same pitch though. It is, great advocate. What a great day for Donegal. Great day for Donegal. Fast. The country. Another great take great in the line. Great line out left. 
It's Moala's got good, got this ball going well. That's good defense of the ball by Turnier. It it is still indeed. Going the other side. Oh. oh, advantage. Silly by Turnier. Silly by Turnier. Now they can have a free cut at it, and I think they're going all the way here. It's now with the scrum half, the back of the ball. Still have advantage. That's good defence by Turnier. Oh, I think we have another injury. No. We might have a card though. Harrison is down there. Let's hope he's okay. Nail biting stuff coming to the inside the final 15 minutes, Moggs. A lot more intensity to the second half, in fairness to both sides. There is. Some more rugby being played. It's been good. This is a big, big play for Ballina Hinge. And Kent kick to the corner here, Mog, try and drive it over. We've been under a bit of pressure in them all. They've been doing really well, so they have they've obviously done their homework on us. Yeah, and I think if you know, one score game if they get in at this stage, so it'll make it a very exciting last fifteen minutes. It will indeed. Certainly have a good relationship with the right wing, I see, Campbell. Ah, he's a good pal of mine. This young ten, what's his name? Dominic. Dominic Clapcott that's he's come on. Very he's, good. He's, he's been impressive, so yeah. he has. He's really managed the game well. So he has. He's the reason they're down here from that 22-22. Bit after your time, was he? He was. Looks very impressive. Good D good. by Ternier. We need to stick in the fight. I think Bimmerney should boom. hit that. Well, I think we've got to go forward. Oh, I don't. I think they've fallen down themselves. Oh, they're still in. They're on here. Trying the corner. Probably what Bannon is there. So 16.30 with the conversion to come. Got a rank and has kicked very well, so it'll be interesting to see how he gets on with this convert. It's right on the touch line on his wrong side. Certainly the momentum is all with Ballon and Hinch. Just pulled it to the left of the post. So Turner with a three-point lead. Boxer, just under 15 minutes to go. Couple of changes here for Turner. Tom Stewart on for Sean McNulty. Make his debut in the AL from Turner. Mike Murphy's on for Matt Caffrey. And Conor McCormick on for Colin Doherty. Nice kick off by Aaron. Good chase by Craig. Certainly the momentum with Ballon a Hinch at the moment. This left, left foot again, Moggs. Same type of physic. Have it covered there with Aaron. Egan. Great tackle on Colin the Butler there. Take by Tom Stewart. Have you run a little bit, Campbell? Yeah, I'm out of breath. I had to go to the Jacks there, Mog. Yes. Knock on there by Terry. Very good attacking position for Banla Hinge right in the middle of the pitch on the halfway line. Turn you'll be hoping for the scrum dominance. 
to continue for this scrum. Connor McCormick back and Tom Stewart on in the front row. It's the proverbial game of two halves, Campbell. That's it. Hopefully now we can get after them in this scrum. Conor McCormick coming in there and Tom Stewart, two big men, making a big difference. Great job, great job. Great, brilliant by Ternier. Unbelievable pressure by Ternier. So it was. I'm not an expert, but... Probably touch and go, Moggs, but look, we'll yeah. take it. You never look a gift horse you in the can, mouth. You know this thing, you see the arm going in by the referee, that's the prop is <laughs> driving in at an angle. That's what we need. I would have probably gone for a reset there, but it's great to see. But great for us, Turner, to get the penalty, which Aaron Egan has pumped in. Say you're right, I think, I think Hinch have been probably harshly done yes. on the scrum side of things, but well, look, we've just been lucky to well, win the ref Well, in fairness, there was a lot of dominance with Turner early on in the scrum, and you know that does have a, an, an impact on the game going on. And it's no Comes at a huge time in the game, so it does, in the middle of the pitch, big scrum penalty to win mm. in the closing minutes. In fairness to Sam Holt, in his first game, Division 1, he's refereed the game extremely well. He has. Fortune, crook it in by Terenier, so it'll be back to the scrum. Interesting if Hinge could have called the line out there. I would have thought. This left foot of this young man, Dominic Clap, caught again. Let's, I'm sure we're going to see it take them out of here. Peter Sylvester constantly shouting, never gives it a break out there. Well, he's great. Great guy to have on the team. Nice lad sometimes. Nice lad sometimes. He sent me a nice text when I was in the hospital wishing me a brilliant, That's unbelievable by Terenier. Taking dominance in the scrum once again. I would amaze Bonner Hinch didn't go for a line out there though. It was a crooked throw in, that's why they couldn't. Well, you're very right there, Campbell. <laughs> that was the old rule. That was, yeah. Make it up as you go well, along. In fairness, <laughs> I think it could be a good new rule. A law, sorry, law. it's a law. It's a law. It's a law, it's not a rule, it's a law. Taren, you're really going for it here. In between the try line and the 22 line out, turn your ball. Let's see what we can muster up and try and r rumble over the line. Again, trusty old claw. Oh, it's, it's excellent. Uh, see, my came on for Adam Chute there. Apologies, Connell. This is a good, this is good, this is good by Charon here. Got a stick in the fight. That's very good. Oh, get Balls. down, Tom. We have We've the got ball. The but don't, don't kick it. Oh, I'm sorry. We have a penalty advantage oh, there, yeah. though, from boys in the side at the scrum. But it's I think we should go for a scrum here, Moggs. We've had complete dominance in the scrum. And there's a yellow card. <laughs> <laughs> I actually think now, in fairness, uh, when the ball's going forward like that, and there is a infringement like a yellow card, I. I'd be more inclined to go under the post for a penalty try. I think we're going to go for a scrum here, Moggs. I can see Pat Laddick over on the left of your screens with his scrum cap, ready, ready for action as always. Never feared of anything, our Patrick. He has many nicknames, you know, Moggs. More nicknames than the encyclopedia, some would say. That's very odd. Here's a tap and go with Terran here. Tarf win with a bonus point against Trinity. Oh, yeah. It's a draw. Oh, it's a draw. Oh, no. They got their fortune. 
Fourth try. Fourth try. We've got the bonus and it's There's a confusion here. All. Maths wasn't a strong point, Camel, was it? Didn't no, it? not much in school was a strong point. Sports really was large and in charge. Lobster fishing? Lobster fishing. You've never caught one though, have you? Oh yeah, I have. If you're looking for lobster, get in touch. We'll do our best. Still no waiting. promises, no promises though. Isn't that it, Mugs? No it's promise. cash up front, I believe. Though, cash Camel, is king, is, cash yeah. is king. Still waiting for the one I had live. Must be... Four years now you're waiting, are yeah. you? Yeah. Well, you'll, be that waiting, lobster, you'll be waiting longer. I think that lobster has a family now. A <laughs> couple of kids. Oh well, yeah, well, it's tough. It's tough at the top, as they say. Yeah. Entering the last five minutes on Bosco's clock. Mike Murphy's entered the pitch for Matthew Caffrey in the second row there. Fairness to both sides. The bench, uh, the bench have had a good impact on the game. Very important for teams to have a big squad considering the 18 league games ahead well, 17 after today so this is a really important stage in the game Ball and Hinge can keep turning her out here they will probably get one more opportunity than they can again the scrum just turn here that little bit that's good scrum again by turning here I don't know mm -hmm. what the number 9 is doing there Jordan Coughlin doing really well to keep the ball at the base great turn. tackle on Jordan Ternier need to keep the ball. Conal Boomer trying to get squeeze himself over the line. Unbelievable team effort by Ternier here. Superb defence on the other side of it. I think I'm going to be held what? up, get the ball back on. Knock, Knock on. on. Oh, we're going back for another penalty. Oh, I didn't know he had a penalty advantage. Must have been the advantage from the scrum. Yeah. They did it really well, Moggs, didn't they, to hold Jordo up there? Superb defence with Van Hinge. They've just they've led from the front. Their defence has been impeccable. Very hard to break down. Bodies on the line from Ballon Hinch. We have a touch judge. What's going with there? Just number 21 and number 9 off green. We're having a kerfuffle. They're kind of just like yeah. one. And um, 21 carried you up hand slap straight to the face of number 9. Green. Okay. To me, I was happy it was just a bit of pushing and shoving. I'll speak to both of them, but there's no, there's no foul play there. Tiny. Two nines for a second. Do you see that? Any? Yeah. All right, all right. I didn't touch you, Lads. What's he just seen? Lads. We've got a couple of minutes left. Can we just no. behave ourselves? No problem. Keep your hands off each other if, if you can manage it. I Thanks. Him. He's the one that slapped me. Ever heard some more call? Penalty still stands. Tearing your scrum. We need a big push here, Moggs, to get over the line because I'll tell you, we're not breaking down that defence too handy. No. Shannon 24, UCD 7, 17, 17, sorry, again, Shannon got their bonus point, 4 tries, free oh, kick, this is the chance to, this is what Hench need now, that wind again, he can smack the ball a fair distance, just an early push there, <laughs> Interesting our, comment. Should have been our a yellow. Enthousi our enthusiastic friend. Good clearance for Banner Hinch. It's a very important line out. 29 14 to Lansdowne in the Young Munster Lansdowne game. Four tries secured by Lansdowne as well, and a bonus point. Good start by Lansdowne. Tarnier under his Tarnier under his Flatten down the hatches here The commentary box is getting It's getting beaten it's getting up line. here <laughs> Our enthusiastic yeah. friends back We need variety yeah. Brian Fitzpatrick beside me here He's feared for his life He doesn't yeah. know what's going to happen We need a big scrum here from Tarnier Listen play boys Listen to it 
to him. Drop the ball. This is what happens when you're the over clock. dominant then. The clock is up on Bosco's. I would imagine there's still about five minutes to go. That was good by Bonnets, get the ball out quickly. Well done by Alan Benning to hold the number eight up. Just keep their shape and discipline here. You don't want to keep out the penalty away. Turn, you're doing really well to get off the line. Jeez. We don't need to give one away any stupid, like a high tackle or anything. Yeah, Alan Benning working ball really ball. hard to get the... F That's a good by Cavalli Hinch. They're going forward here. Well done, Arne Egan. Oh, penalty. Penalty advantage offside, I think. Coming back for the penalty. Potential look to go quick here, I'd say. I would imagine they'll go for the kick. It's back more, back more towards the halfway, I think, Sam. I think it's... This is a huge result for it. Inch if they come down here and well deserved, they've come down and fought every inch. They've done really well to stick in it. We're going for the kick. Just to tie the game up. So well. I believe there's time for a kick off after, but this is a it's well within his range. Drop, eh, Mugs? It's had a very good game, Connor. He has. I think he's pulled it just to the left of the post. And that's it. Turn your hang on for a 16. 13 victory and thanks to Brian for everything <laughs> for able to work the cameras and everything and thanks to Campbell for his, his uh, interesting off. commentary we escaped we escaped through the skin of our teeth well done to Hench done for